Hi guys, so I'm just going to bring you a very quick DIY tour of myself. Um, so yeah, as you enter in later, I'll show you the entry. What I want to focus on is this and this is how it looks like in all my advertisements and my pictures. It looks like it's two wings. This is the first and this is the second. So um, once you enter in, you'll begin to see this very nice, I would say like a Californian style, LA style kind of home where you have the indoor and the outdoor space. Okay. So yes, although the land is a little bit of an odd shape, but the house itself is actually very much regular in shape. So every corner of the house is, is very much utilized. So this architect is by RT plus Q. And so as you enter, you this is the living space, all right? And then there's the powder room and this very cute <laughs> little pool right here. They're in the midst of finishing up some maintenance work. Um, but yeah, you'll begin to see this is a very nice area where the glass can actually open all the way out and so is this area so just to give you another look so you just imagine it's going to be really indoor outdoor living over here then outside you can actually put your outdoor settee and so far and stuff so what's good about this is if your kids or of yourself you have pool parties and all that uh, and people are super wet you know or something they instead of walking through the house they to the powder room they will enter into this um, toilet here directly so let me bring you in to see this shower over here that is actually um, an ensuite linked to this particular bedroom over here so yeah this can be a guest bedroom or a study room up to you and then um, this actually leads to stairway down to the basement which is your entertainment area so another look at this place now let's bring you to the front so this is the car park area as you enter you begin to see this beautiful walkway it's kind of like a resort or something and you have a very cute, nice little water feature here. And as you enter, you will see this entry foyer, um, which is, I would say, is a very Brit or American style where you have your entry foyer here. I can imagine like just set these chairs where your guests come, they will wait over here, you know, or just have a nice chit chat over here for a while. And then this is just a little store area for the DB box and stuff, which can also act as your shoe cabinet. And um, yeah, it's really windy because it's north-south facing. And this is your kitchen, dry kitchen. And this is actually your living space. So this is your dry kitchen. You'll get to see our Fisher & Pickel um, appliances, which also has the beautiful pool view. And as you enter, this is actually bedroom number one, um, which is can also be doubled up as a study if you want. You can have the same nice pool view as well. And then it has its own, you know, split DC unit, your floor to ceiling kind of uh, covered area. And then this is the shower that we were talking about that the guests can also use after they have been in the pool or your own kids after they use it. Oh, it can also be a very nice guest room for your friends and family if they come over. Now, so that's your dry kitchen and this is your wet kitchen. You have another double door fridge over here and then you also have your stove, your hot, your, your hood as well. Yeah, so you can seal off this wet cooking area and then this is the helper's toilet, really high ceiling. Um, this is the area for your um, washer dryer and this is actually your helper's room if you have a helper. Welcome to the second level. You'll see this beautiful bridge over here. Right now, they're undergoing some sort of maintenance work but on the usual day, you'll be able to see the pool as well. And if you want more privacy, you can always install curtains at the side. But yeah, it's a really nice, very unique bridge that is very RT plus Q um, style. So yeah, you'll get to see this is the Junior Master. Very nice and bright. And I just love this concept of this huge bath bathroom area here. You can see the bathtub, double vanity, your shower, your WC area. If you want more privacy, these um, flaps outside, they can actually close and they're on timer as well. And you have your walk-in wardrobe space over here and a little study nook or dresser area there. So one more look at the Junior Master. If you were to tilt these shades a little bit, you can still see a little bit of the pool as well. All right, let's bring you on to the Master. Leading on to the Master, you will see the lift that goes all the way down from basement to the attic. You will see your walk-in wardrobe over here and also your double vanity 
and this is also another dressing area and this is a very very interesting toilet your WC is here and this is your shower area very interesting very unique you need to really appreciate this um, yeah and it has, goes all the way up to the skylight over there of course if you want privacy you can always install blinds or something over here yeah Alright, it's really big and bright. You can definitely fit like a queen size bed and also like sofa area over here. Okay, again, these shades here on the outside, they are louvers that they can be timed, time coded or rather timed so that any part of the day you want it to be closed or open, it will automatically do so. Now let's head to the fourth bedroom. Alright, so you can see the fourth bedroom over here. Really good space, you can fit a queen size bed as well, your wardrobe, a huge shower area here too. Very nice and bright as well. Let's go on to the third floor. As we come up to the third story, you'll see this beautiful attic space here. This can be like a family room, this is where the cold air comes out as well as a vent. Um, so you don't have a split AC unit here, but the cooler will come out, so just FYI. And yeah, this can be like a very nice beanbag chill area for kids, especially for kids to hang out. And again, this wonderful bridge that leads to the study room. But now, I want you to bring your attention to the last bedroom over here. And look at that view, oh my goodness. So this is, has a pretty much a hotel concept where they put the sink on the outside. And then inside is a shower and your WC as well. So yeah, and then this is like the storage area where you can have a lot of storage. They make use of how the attic should be like. And I just want you to see the view. Look at that. You have the view of the entire Namli area all the way to Diliden, the whole Holland area. You're on one of the highest elevated ground in Namli. And finally, the last room over here is really your study area. So it's, an, it's a kind of like a narrow space, but oh, I just love this framing of this like, this here is so RT plus Q. But yeah, very interesting framing here. It can be a study or your Pilates or your gym area, you know, or family boardroom area, whatever you call it. A nice private space, maybe away from the kids. Welcome to the basement. As we come down, this is the super spacious entertainment or second living space. I can totally imagine family times, pool table or an indoor cinema if you want, your own private cinema. That door actually leads up to the swimming pool upstairs as well. Super gorgeous. And as you come in, unlike any other basement, this basement is nice and bright because of this air well over here, as you can see. And if you want it to be totally bright, we have built-in shutters as well that can go all the way down for security reasons as well. And you have the final bedroom over here, which is really nice and spacious. It can also be your guest room or one of the rooms for your kids. It has its own window panel, split AC unit over there. And you also have your own dedicated um, ensuite shower here. And just an additional space here that can also be converted into a wardrobe if you want. But yeah, otherwise, it's a really cool space. Another look here. Final words, this home is not for a typical buyer um, that you know prefers the usual huge entry foyer area and regular land shape. Yeah, but this buyer would appreciate the uniqueness of the property that is one of a kind, one of its kind. It, no other property looks like that. No other detached home looks like that. So DM me or leave a comment if you're interested to see this place.